us a big gar, got us a pile of them fruits. Look at that right there. And it's only Saturday. We got all weekend, dude. I even had me a natty light this morning yet. Big old sucker. Got pretty that. Yeah. Thank you, buddy. Let's go make them gar balls, dude. Look how pretty this old meat is. So I said, boy, let's get it, dude. I get a lot of requests to smoke some meat. We're about to smoke this old garfish. I start off with that pretty back scrap and I cut it like into finger sticks. Just like this. Beautiful steaks. I like them long. Just like this. And we're gonna smoke, look how pretty that meat is. We're gonna smoke that. Look at that. Just layer that beautiful alligator gar meat out. We're gonna vacuum seal that in that old W sauce about three or four hours, and we're gonna put it on the little chubby smoker, and I'm gonna tell you a little more about that little chubby. Now, I'm gonna take all that beautiful alligator gar meat right there, put it in that bowl, good bit of that old two-step. Remember, you get that at that Walmart, dude. A Little bit of that W sauce, put that in there like that. We're gonna mix that around. Coat it all up nice and neat. So I like to vacuum seal that, soaks all that goodness in there. I'm gonna vacuum seal it and put it in the ice box probably four to six hours. Then I'm gonna take that back out and hit that on that smoker. Boom, got it like that. Nice and neat, right into the ice box, dude. I'm gonna let that sit for a couple hours. This is the second batch right here. Let that soak in that goodness. Look at that. Got the juices flowing. That alligator guard gonna suck all that W sauce in there. And it's gonna suck to that smoke and it's gonna be just money, dude. Sealing up nice and tight. Boom. Let it rip, dude. In the ice box. Grab your cold one while you're here. While we wait, we hydrate. The juice is loose. That's a pretty sight, right there, T boy. We got the lump charcoal going, but I don't want to leave nobody out in the smoking world. Got some wood chips. Throw that in there like that. Get that going. Don't forget them rabbit pellets. Throw that in there too. Got that going like that. We're gonna put a little beer in this water. Oh, we got the smoke going now, nah, dude. Shut that up. Let me tell you about this. I sent my wife. I said, go get me a smoker. And she's like, I don't know what you want to get. I said, when you see it, you gonna know. So she got this smoker. Guess what the nickname is? Lil Chubby. And she brought it home. Go figure that. 200 degrees for two hours, dude. Put it in the little chubby and let the little chubby do what the little chubby does. Two hour long time to wait and hydrate, dude. Let's get it. Been about two and a half hours, dude. Let's, oh, look at here. Let's pull these beautiful smoked garfish. And I'm gonna show you how I eat that on a cracker, dude. Look how pretty that is. Let us break one real quick. Look at here. Straight, look at that. Fresh meat. Bro, I'm telling you, if you ain't done that, you need to do it. Mm -mm -mm. Give it a little run, dude. Let me show you how pretty that turns out. But you know, put that on a cracker, dude. Hit it with a little bit. Just a little bit of that old gator drool. Don't be a fool. Put that on a cracker, dude. Smoke garfish for the win. Mm-mm. Yeah, I ain't a cracker system. Stop that bomb, dude. Mm -mm -mm.